Welcome to another video on image generation with stable diffusion using Comfy UI. In this video, let's have a look how we can change the image on the left into the image on the right, a completely different hairdo using inpainting. This is the workflow that I use. Um, here on the left we have a standard uh, prompt and then we have a couple of blocks to prepare a latent image based on an actual uh, already available image. And then we follow that up with a checkpoint loader and a sampler, the efficient sampler of a couple of videos ago. Then on the right we have a latent upscaler and an image upscaler which we can switch on once we are satisfied with this image. Okay, so let's have a look what we need to prepare the latent image. Let's first just take these blocks out and build it up from scratch. The first thing we need obviously is an image loader. So let's right click, add a node go to image and find load image that's the one we need and let's put it somewhere over here well we can uh, modify the sizes later the next block that we need is a vae encoder to uh, uh, change this pixel image into a latent image so let's right click again add node uh, latent and there we find a VAE encode. Let's put it over there. Let's create the necessary connection. The image is going to the input of the encoder. The VAE, we take that from our checkpoint and the output, the latent image, well, we are not going to send it over there. We are going to use a mask because we want to uh, create a mask on our image. That's the part we want to inpaint. Let's find that mask uh, add node. We go to latent, then to inpaint, and then set latent noise mask. That's the one I like to have. Um, well, let's make it uh, neat and tidy. The output of it is going to my sampler and the VAE encoder output it goes to the input of the mask. And then we have here on the image, we have a mask and that is what we send to this mask. And now, uh, yeah, we are actually prepared. So let's load an image now. And uh, yeah, well, I'm going to try find that girl. Wait a second. Uh, I think this is her. Yeah, this is her. Now we are going to create a mask, which is done by right clicking on the picture and then uh, open in mask editor. And then this happens and I can make my cursor a bit thicker. Uh, we don't have to be very careful. It's uh, uh, AI. So if I take out an ear or an, an eyebrow, that does not matter at all because uh, the AI knows that this is the picture of a girl and it will automatically recreate that. This is the mask. When we are done, we click save to note. In the prompt, I have written woman with short blonde hair. I loaded a protovision checkpoint. Uh, and well, let's uh, do just 16 steps and see what comes out. And if all goes well, well, we should get that woman that uh, we saw earlier with the new hairdo. And this is actually all. This is how easy it is to do in painting in Comfy UI. The workflow is available in the text that goes with this video. Maybe see you back in the next video. And in the meantime, have fun.